know about the title what's going on. And I'm here with my little sister. And we say friend, right? My name is Kiki. This is Kiki, y'all. She has a business. And we're gonna let her talk about that a little later. This is my sister. She has a business too. She'll be glamour by your name. Yeah. Say yours. Mika Fora Eyelashes. Mika Fora Eyelashes. And then we got be the people that you see every day. They're gonna be global. When you think about a biz, you have to think on a global level. So I'm welcoming y'all to the channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. When you do that, it pushes us up in the algorithm. It makes us relevant. And I wanted to meet my sister because she went and got something for me. They've been working with me. I got a photo shoot at the end of the month. I have not revealed what it's for yet, but I will be sharing it with you guys. And we about to eat some Mexican food. So the next thing y'all see will be me showing y'all the school, and I'll be right back. Oh y'all, oh my God. All of us got the same stuff. I just wanted to show off everything. Y'all look at this, this looks so good. We about to eat this food, we gonna bless this food, and we will be back and talk to y'all later. You see the inside of the, um, oh, we can't even see the food. When I push food, pretty this what we need to have, a Mr. Mukbang. In the restaurant. Yeah, in the restaurant. I can do it in the restaurant. They just got the music. I can't. What I'm going to have to do now. Like you talking to the camera now. I'm going to have to fast forward. Through there. And then stop and go. Stop and go. Now look at this. They gave me some extra cheese. Oh, yeah. I can't eat the sauce and stuff right now. But I knew it would have made me fun. I did, I said, let's stay. I really like beans. You like the beans? They're right, they're right, right, yeah. I ain't never done the beans. Really? I love me some refried beans. I always do the right. Well, I, um, let's get food. Look, I eat it all day. When I go to Taco Bell, I made them take my bangs off everything. So you never taste had it, but mm -mm. I done had it like when I didn't want it. And I'm like, uh, -uh I ain't gonna never get that no more. It'd be like at Taco Bell or something. But like, I like Taco Bell, baby. You do? I don't. I just, the only reason I don't because they take the meat away. To me. See, I stopped getting that meat and I get beans. Beans, beans, burritos with the green. Mm -hmm. It's good. And it was delicious. So right now we're talking about the goals. What's your goals for the next 30 days? Uh, my goals is to keep practicing uh, my makeup. And uh, I just bought some new products so that I can use and perfect. And I'm so mad, y'all. I lost the uh, the base that you use for eyeshadow. Oh, no. I lost it. And I just bought it. It was $8. But we got we to gotta go back and get that. It was $8 for this and <laughs> so Ooh, I'm okay. gonna get some more because I gotta pour it to myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do. You do. So, come on, girl. What's your goals for the next 30 days? What you um, eat? For the next 30 days, I actually planned on to start back on my uh, lashes, really. Mm -hmm. I'm really planning on doing it in the month of June and July. Mm -hmm. you know, summertime now, everybody wearing lashes. Everybody wearing lashes. Like, folks can't go out the house without lashes. Right. Exactly. You know how to do the individual? No. Ooh, we good. Money <laughs> in it, money in it. So, for the next 30 days, you guys, I have to get back on a lot of things. Um, I used to do lives, like, with moms and stuff like that. And, um, like, teaching them certain things and... Oh, you can have all that. Okay. And um, I want to get back on it, like going live, making myself present, and things of that nature. Also, the next 30 days, we'll be taking care of, better care of my health, more water, more activity, things of that nature. Because, you guys, I have a big surprise. I don't know if I'm going to release. It's going to be released in July. I'm thinking about releasing it uh, on the 4th of July. 
the same day I release our 4th of July vlog, I'm thinking. Mm. Anyway, y'all get to see it either way, okay? So, that's gonna be it for right now. Uh, our lunch was delicious, of course. Y'all know it. And, um, yeah. That's it. I'm here with my sister. I'm here with a friend. And, well, she's like a sister, too. But I just wanna just... Y'all, yeah, I'm full. I'm full. Let me get out of here. I'm full. I'm a child with my sister. And we just left from out to eat, you guys. I'm in here looking for some stuff myself, even though they looking for some. I say I walk around. But I hope y'all are having a good week or weekend. Who knows when y'all gonna see this vlog? I am uploading every day in the month of June. So make sure y'all liking, talking to me, everything. You know what? They can definitely. I need to go back and relook at some things. Hey, ladies. All right. So, I am headed home. All right. It was a very productive day. And it's hot out here. It is so hot. So I had a good little conversation with my sister. I didn't share everything because I understand like you can't disclose of everything for other people. But I've been telling my sisters there I have a twin sisters actually. The other one wasn't here. The other person was one of their friends. And yeah. I've been motivating them. They're young entrepreneurs. And one advice I have been giving them is to don't base your business on the people you just know. You have to look at a business. Yeah, I have been telling them not to base their business on just because they know people and different things like that. I told them to think on a global level because it's one of the things I learned when I began to do my coaching and stuff like that. That's another part of me that you all will be seeing in July. I'm just not ready to share with the world on that part. But I do want you to know I wanted things to be together. And I just would say... I forgot what I was saying. I just don't like when I see people talking about each other. It's another. I'm, I'm my mind all over the place, y'all. I'm sorry. I want a professional waxing, y'all. My hair is just hot. Professional waxing. I mean, professional facial. What I'm, what I'm talking about? Facial. Hey. A um professional. I'm so nosy. A professional facial, y'all. I need a professional facial. Okay. But I'm also watching. Cause I got people running back and forth. I need to go right to a gas station. So I guess y'all spend the rest of the day with me. Mm -hmm. I look at the new shoes I got. But when I told you I was coming out of my comfort zone. I'll tell y'all more about this soon. I've never owned a pair like these before. And I'll be talking to y'all about it. Really, really soon. I pray I can fit these shoes, y'all. got seven days to get them back if I can't. 
So basically what y'all are doing is spending a day with me without the kids. And it's really, and in times lapse, you're only spending about an hour with me. But it'll seem like the full day. And I'll meet back up with my family later on today. So I'll be back in a minute when I get to the gas station. So, as you know, I titled this video, um, I left my family at home to go out. <sighs> I was feeling a little guilty. That's why I had to turn this video on. For so many years, you guys, this is all I know is taking care of my family. You know, despite if people feel like I do it a little or a lot or whatever the case is. Hold on. I'm at a light, y'all. Hold on. All right, so I got my microphone hooked up now. So, like, I don't want to be at, go out and have to feel guilty about anything the young ladies that i was with even though like his family and her friends and stuff like that it's still young women who are looking for something better in life and i felt like i had an opportunity to talk with them when i had to meet her and you know i don't want to feel guilty as a mom because i didn't take my kids with me or my husband with me or different things like that and i have to learn how to embrace this new time in my life it's not an era of wilding now it's not an era of anything like that but the more you start putting in time on whatever it is that god has perhaps called you to do you're going to meet different people you're going to be probably called to do this or do that as long as it's being used towards that particular thing you know and I just wanted to come in and just say that because I I purposely wanted to name this video this. So, I could let moms know that it's okay to have a moment or a day. Or really, I've been gone one hour. It's, it's okay to have an hour and 30 minutes to yourself. Because you know what? 24 hours in a day goes to my family. Or... 20 hours of a day or 19 hours of a day y'all or it's going to somebody's job so i just wanted to encourage moms families dads somebody may be feeling a little guilty that they got out and went and played ball or got out and went to see a movie or got out went out to eat without the family or i don't know whatever it is don't feel guilty about it i need a new 